North Carolina Representative Trisha Cotham says her mom and son were politically targeted in a road rage incident this week. This comes four months after Cotham made the controversial decision to switch political parties, giving Republicans a supermajority in the General Assembly. Our chief political correspondent Emma Withrow joins us live from Cotham's district after digging into this alleged road rage incident. Emma? So guys, I reached out to the Mint Hill Police Department, CMPD, as well as Matthews Police Department, asking for the incident reports of this alleged politically motivated road rage incident, which is how Representative Trisha Cotham is describing it. None of these different police departments said that any sort of reports were filed. But we obviously got this information from Representative Cotham's Facebook post, where she says her mother, Pat Cotham, was driving with her son when an angry woman pulled up in Toyota, started honking her horn and screaming vulgar obscenities at them. Cotham also pointing out in this Facebook post that harassing and targeting her family is wrong. Susan Mills, the vice chairwoman of the NCGOP, says Trisha has been dealing with these politically motivated attacks for months. As a mom, I was absolutely horrified that somebody would do that. Children are off limits no matter what. And the fact that you would put a child's life in danger just because you're upset with something the parent did is unacceptable. And no matter what political persuasion you are, there, there's no reason to do that. I reached out to both Trisha and Pat for comment on this alleged road rage incident. Neither of them got back to us, but we'll definitely keep you guys updated if we do hear back from either of them. For now, reporting live in Mint Hill, Emma Withrow, Queen City News. All right.